Hello everyone. Today I thought it would be nice to create one of my favourite mini beasts. Can you guess what it is? It's red with lots of black spots. That's right, it's a ladybird. Now I'm very lucky in my garden. I've got some lovely oval shaped stones. But if you don't have these, don't worry. You can find other stones to use. I'm going to make 10 ladybirds, but you can just make one big one if you want. So I've got some red paint. There we go. Nice and thick. Take a while to dry. There we are, that one can dry there. Paint this one. There we go. There we go, that can dry too. And here's one I made earlier. This is dry now, nice and dry. Now I haven't got any tiny paint brushes, but I've used a cotton bud, they work really well. And first of all, I'm going to paint this head. There we go. Then I'm going to paint a line down the middle you know where his wings are to divide him. So I'll let that dry for a while. And I've got one here that's dry. Now I've done a set of ladybirds, the one to 10. And this one needs to be number four. So he's gonna have four spots on his back. And if you count them carefully, one, two, three, four. There we go. Now I'm very lucky. I've managed to get hold of some wiggly eyes. I'll stick on my ladybird. So it's blue there. There's some blue there. If you can't get wiggly eyes, you could stick paper on. You, if you've got white paint or any colour paint really, you could paint the eyes. There we are, there's my number four ladybird. Now I thought it would be nice if I made some leaves with the numbers on. So let me see, where's number four? There he is, that's his leaf. Four spots on the number four leaf. And perhaps you can have fun searching for numbers, searching for ladybirds in your garden. Perhaps you can play lots of number games. Bye everyone, see you soon.